Hey everyone, my name is Kerry Wolf and welcome back to Homestuck. We are here with Spade Slick about to burn this freaking mansion down. So take one last look at its glorious greenness and then watch it burn down and blazes. <laughs> and now SS exit. Now that we had to burn this place down for some reason. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> is, is the little remote control thing from like way back when <laughs> yeah they're like what the shit <laughs> what the shit dude this was their secret escape hatch you see it's all so clear now when things get too hot to handle the doc and his posse duck out of the clock and into the idiot wagon for a little spin through infinite oblivion with some giant octopus things thanks for the tip crowbar thank you so very fucking much Okay, so where do we go now? <laughs> Hang on a minute. What's that? Is that? Could it really be? I don't know, dude. Could it really be what? You don't need a fancy robotic eye to tell you what that is. You know exactly what that is. Are you not gonna tell us? I swear to God. <laughs> but you, it's the fucking jackpot. What? Of what? Oh, is that what that was? Wait, what? Okay, we all just hanging out here. <laughs> the other Jack that was sat here and then Dirk that was sat here. Oh, what's this? Wait. John? Oh, right, he was sleeping. But now he's still kind of sort of blinking in and out of- Okay, never mind, he's gone. <laughs> Thought he was blinking in and out of existence, but nope, he's just gone. And he left that ring of life behind. That can't be good. Is that Nana? <laughs> no, it's not Nana, it's John. <laughs> Zap. Um... Are you dead, John? Because I think this is the land of the dead. Super bizarre. What does this mean? Zap, okay. I mean, you didn't think that instead of having him split into a million pieces, it, he just keeps teleporting at random intervals? To like every place ever, right? Is that is, is that what it means? I'm really beginning to think that's what it means. Now he's seeing himself. It's so it's like a very bizarre time traveling. Or maybe he is a ghost. I don't know. Okay, just when you're about to see yourself, you zap away again. <laughs> zap. Um, oh, you go to this moment where she got her arm and eye blown off, I guess. Um, <laughs> is this gonna turn into the, one of those weird things where it's like actually John was the character that led everything up to this point kind of situation? <laughs> gulp. Uh, don't gulp, uh, save her. Well I, well, I guess not, because you're gonna zap out of ex uh, to another place again. Yep, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Oh jeez. You gotta zap here as well? He's just zapping everywhere. Why, John? Why? <laughs> I know, right? Just seeing some kid kiss some decapitated head. Very weird. <laughs> John. Oh, John. He's like traveling to every point in time, man. So bizarre. Oh, God. <laughs> it's just gonna. Oh. Whoa. Calm, calm down, ancestor there. Calm down. <laughs> hiss. <laughs> the longest hiss ever. She's just very protective of her babu. Dude, he could be the person that writes down history because he's seen it all by now. Bro? He's like in every moment for like a blink of time and then he's gone. <laughs> okay, how does that just work? Why is he in the damn movie? I mean, I guess if he was like zapped there while they were being filmed, I guess, but... 
<laughs> this looks so ridiculous. Look at this. John's just like staring with the most. <laughs> I don't even know what that face is. Tears of joy? Tears of some other bizarre thing? I don't know. Act 6, intermission 5, intermission 6. Ugh, back to Caliborn again. I did it. I conquered the Maroon Stripe Planet, thus unlocking the final and most powerful Toad Golem of all. Wow, he's so perfect, so huge, so strong. I love him being strong. Finally, the ideal minion with the type of power I admire the most, which is being a huge, strong guy with enormous, powerful muscles. Yes! Oh yeah, I also got Green Stripe Hat. He's good too. In that, he is also large and relatively strong and mean. He flips a coin too, I think, which is also cool. Oh, and don't tell me what they do. All I care about that, all I care about is that they're big and strong. Do not spoil my moment of triumph with more of your human monkey earth business. What? Nothing to say? Um... What? When did he come here? <laughs> what? Yes, this is good. You finally, you're finally learning who's boss, and soon. Everyone else will too. Now I have to conquer the Black Planet. This one is a different thing from the others. My sources tell me, by which I mean, the clown tells me that this planet has been claimed by the Black Queen herself. Oh, you're into the eighth, the eighth planet, the last one. I would need to overthrow her to win. As such, in a stroke of brilliant cleverness, my brain devised an idea. I recruited Jack Noir to help settle our mutual score. Really, getting Jack to do violent things for me always strikes me as such a good plan. So I might as well just do it always, rather than always thinking of my thinking of new stuff, which is hard to do. He would make a good friend. If the concept of friendship wasn't horrid and meaningless to me, therefore, I would think of a way to dispose of him once as useful this is over. Good God, Calibor. It's bad form to leave stray noirs wandering around. Don't tell myself any of this. My treachery to him is meant to be a surprise. Ha ha ha. Uh, hello? Where the fuck did you go? Are you going to tell me what you think of my great plan? Or deride me in some fashion? For my juvenile conduct and poor critical thinking skills? Well, you unspeakably putrid and fatuous blabbermouth? I demand that you talk to me. Okay, I see how it is. You have decided you will no longer allow me to browbeat you into helping me through sheer force of petulance. It may surprise you to know. I am just as capable of respecting that as I am of throwing a tantrum about it. I don't need you anymore. I don't need anyone. Eh, now you- oh jeez. He's grown up quite a bit since the last time we saw him, isn't it? Cause that is a pretty giant caliber. <laughs> Boo yeah. Spike. And then John zaps here. What does that say? I- what? I can't even read that. Something stare down. Oh, intense stare down. Why is that font so ridiculously hard to read? Intense stare down. Alright, did you actually grow up at all, Caliborn? <laughs> or was this a different rendering of what you like? A different style of, <laughs> of rendering. <laughs> How long is this intense stare down gonna go down? He's just gonna zap away to another place anyway. You know, eventually. Longest intense stare down ever. Intense stare down. Also, zoom really into the eyes. Really zoom. Okay. How long are we just gonna stare at each other? Uh, what? He punched them out of the page? What? Dude, what? Oh, hey, I'm John now. <laughs> oh, that's fun. We okay. This is kind of ridiculous, <laughs> but kind of fun. Ooh. All right, enough of that. End of Act Six, Intermission Five, Intermission Six. If I can even click on this, I I don't know actually. Can I click on this? Why there? Okay, it worked. Zap. <laughs> he got zapped while he was being you know punched all the way into oblivion. What? Uh, that's what I want to know, John. What? has this whole zapping business been about?
Is that the same war? I mean, I guess basically Jade's war. Does this mean? I don't know, John. I have the very same question. We're here? Yeah, apparently. You took like the ultimate shortcut though. Hello? Is anyone there? Jade? Nana? Where is good old Nana? I haven't seen her in a while. Jaspers? Dave Sprite? Anybody? <laughs> regular Dave? I mean, I'm sure regular Dave is around here somewhere. Where is everyone? This sucks. <laughs> John, dot dot dot. At least you stopped zapping. Sigh. Isn't this where Jake was? Because this is where Solus came in to give him the finger. You chance upon the slab of the Jaded Fool's Enu. You don't know what the slab is called that, but that's what the slab is called. It looks like a good spot to decompress after your strange ordeal through canon space. Oh jeez, everyone's coming here. Look, they've caught up to them. Like truly, they've caught up to them. Everyone is gonna like unite here <laughs> and meet up kind of in like some weird bizarre way. Oh, drunk Rose. At least she got here. Oh my god, guys, we're here! So, has anyone figured out how we're actually gonna stop this meteor? Or was there- or was three years not enough time to solve that problem? Well, it would have been if anyone was actually trying to solve that problem, but evidently not, you know? No, we haven't. Oh my god, we're still traveling at the speed of light and we only seem to be picking up steam. I don't think that's possible, dude. In fact, I'm not sure we were ever traveling at light speed. I think maybe there's been some bogus science in circulation that we've been chumped into getting behind. What? Just saying. No, I'm um, just saying. We came all this way and we're all gonna die. <laughs> okay, whoa. Can you calm them freaky smiles that back there? I don't believe this. How could we not have thought this through better? It's like the reckoning version 2. 0.0 or 3.0 or wait maybe 4.0 if we're counting the before assess uh forget fuck this says i'm saying how could it all boil down to yet another meteor hurtling towards skaya serving as the harbinger of our imminent demise except this time we're riding the fucking harbinger which is ironic when you think about it we were brought into this life riding a meteor makes sense that's how we're all go we'll all go out <laughs> man pull it together this thing has to have some escape pods or something I mean, I don't think so, Dave, but nice thinking? <laughs> Where? I never saw any. Maybe they were being stored in the hypergravity chamber? We have a hypergravitoid chain hick bear? bear, bear? <laughs> or I guess maybe we could just sort of hop up and like fly away. That's a really good point. You guys could do that. I mean, I don't think that would work in real science reality, but eh, you know, why not? <laughs> Why, you abhorrent column of smarmy filth. You always did know how to rub salt in the wound. What about those of us who can't fly? You know I can't fly, and you know it's a sore subject for me. I swear to god, this meteor needs one of those baby on board things on the back. But like a grub instead of baby for max fidelity to the gag because trows. I know you can't fly, dude. Obviously, I would just carry you or something. I'd rather fucking die. Whoa, car cat, take it a little farther. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I have a feeling everything's gonna work out. Rose, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Bark is a jade. <laughs> She's not smiling anymore. Dude, did you just bark? What? No, I didn't bark. I thought that was you. Why would I bark? Well, why would the f why the fuck would I bark? Because you're having a mental breakdown. Why don't you have a mental? Go fuck yourself. Or or wait. Then use your alleged time powers to make a copy of yourself and turn this audacious fantasy into a sensual reality. That went off into a really weird turn. Nah, the bark. There it was again. The bark happened again. Wasn't me. Who the fuck is barking? Kanaya, did you bark? You fucking with us, Miriam? Hiss. Why is she hissing? Trezzy, was it you? Grr. Okay, what's wrong with them? You, you guys have, you guys have animal selves inside you too. Is that why they're reacting to the dog? That's, that's so weird. What is it? What are you looking at? 
Maybe the mayor barked. Mayor? Was that you? Haha, <laughs> I bet it was. God, I love the mayor. He's so full of surprises. Look, guys, I love the mayor too, but he wouldn't do that sort of thing. Oh, God, it's the Jade that's under control. She's going full dog on us. Full god dog on us. Gamzy. Gamzy, man, he's always hiding there. Being an asshole. Hey, guys. Um. Oh, that was a, a less angry greeting than I expected. But she is fully here to probably either murder or kidnap. Long time no see. Yeah, Jay, it's been three damn years and you come here looking like some kind of crazy person? <laughs> What's with these faces, man? These faces, I swear. Hilarious. Oh, guys, it's been three years. We're finally here. Meanwhile, John is just having a chill time on this slab. Wow, that tiny wall. <laughs> Deepest sigh of all. Oh yeah, she did shrink them down. Wait, but since they're out now, it unshrink. Why is he still here? <laughs> Aerosol is still coming up. <laughs> he came here to give a finger, but unfortunately Jake is not here. I actually don't know where Jake is. So bored. Oh, poor you. Hey dude, at least you're not zapping around anymore. Look on the bright side. Pop? What? Has he just gone insane because he's so bored? Oh my god, guys, saw- wait, was he playing Sots here? I was like, by way too fast. <laughs> okay, where'd you get the iron from? <laughs> hell yes. Dude, hell fucking yes. No way you had time to do all that. Oh, look, he fell back in love with the movie. Dude, what the hell? He's just so bored, he did all this stuff. Hey look, everybody, they're here! Um... <laughs> John is just like, oh hey guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, what just happened? Clearly that was some Beck magic there. The Jade zapped them all here, but why? I thought she was going off like, you know, a little crazy on us. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is this the password page? It's the password, but I still don't know the password yet. Right, guys? I mean, it's been so long, I kind of forgot about it, but we still don't know the password yet, right? 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 I have no idea. Anyway, I don't know the password right now, so... And that says, well, hold up. Was there any point that we saw a password related to Terezi? I feel like we haven't. So I'm gonna say no. Whoop, I still don't know what the password is, <laughs> so I'm gonna continue on. I mean, maybe I know it, but I feel like I don't know it. <laughs> Look, he's so happy to see his friends! And a back 6, intermission 5. Oh my god, guys, spent a long intermission. And it ends on our friends being all united. Yay, reunited! After three damn years. End of year 4. Sweet, dude. What? Are we, are we putting in another disc? Damn, dude. Remove disc 2? Really? Really? You don't say. Oh, jeez, what the hell? <laughs> uh, Spade Slick White being a dick and breaking our stuff? That is your rubble leg, right? <laughs> Badly drawn. <laughs> Insert this three. Oh, jeez, no, why? No! No! Say it ain't so! I don't want his ugly ass circle disc. <laughs> Are you serious? So you tell me this three is basically be like all about Calibor, right? Oh, what is it? But jeez, what the fuck? Is it, is it slowing down? <laughs> there is no this three, you asshole. Oh, you're the one who made this ugly thing and put it in there. <laughs> the end. <sighs> He's so insane and annoying. <laughs> This is like a revamp of the other thing that was like this, but it's all Hussie's face. Oh jeez. Oh, what the hell? Ah ha ha ha, and then the ha's go smaller? Oh my god, the ha's are so small. 
What? Well, all right, guys. Before we go on to Act Six, Act Six. Oof, so many. Finally, out of the Act Act Acts, I think. Or actually, you know what? The, the next one's probably be like Act Six, Act Six, Act One. I bet. The acts never end. It just goes on forever. But in any case, I I guess we we're done with this too. I don't know. He did say there is no this three, and then he called us an asshole. So I don't know. Maybe there's like a a two point five this. Because pretty sure the removing this two part is actually a thing that happened. Or maybe there's just no this after this. I don't understand this stuff, dude. <laughs> In any case, I'm guessing the next part is going to be really focused on him. Also, I might need to look some stuff up because the password page came back again. So I just want to make sure that we didn't, I didn't miss it. But I'm pretty sure I didn't get any passwords yet. But I gotta double check on that. So for now, I will leave this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching this. Let me know what you think about it. And I will see you guys in the next video.